Hello, today we're going to talk about diabetes and its uh, devastating effects on the lower extremity. Uh, diabetes has a dramatic effect on the entire body, on the eyes, the kidneys, uh, the lower extremity, uh, the peripheral vascular system, and the peripheral nervous system as well. Um, today I would like to talk about some of the effects that diabetes has on the lower extremity. 26 million people across the United States has diabetes, and that's just of those who are diagnosed. 60 to 70 percent of these people will go on to develop diabetic peripheral neuropathy uh, where they have an inability to feel their feet and sometimes can be quite painful. 25 percent of these who develop diabetic peripheral neuropathy will go on to have what's called a diabetic foot ulceration and half of these will develop a diabetic foot infection that will likely end up uh, in a hospitalization secondary to sepsis and even to limb loss. 20, every 20 seconds, uh, somebody across the world uh, is, is having a limb amputated. 80% of these amputations are caused by uh, non-traumatic diabetic peripheral neuropathy causes. Um, with these amputations, there is a five-year mortality rate of 68%. That's only second to lung cancer, which is at 86% five-year mortality rate. That's higher than breast cancer, higher than prostate cancer, and many other cancers that are very common. Um, a 10-year, 40% mortality rate is had in diabetics who develop a foot ulceration, likely secondary to diabetic peripheral neuropathy. Now, what can we do about this devastating disease and potentially fatal effects of the disease as well? A recent thompson reuter study in July of 2011 has shown that a multidisciplinary approach with podiatrists and lower extremity physicians at the, as the gatekeepers, uh, along with endocrinologists, vascular surgeons, plastic surgeons, and family practitioners, um, along with a good patient education, can decrease these amputation rates by 50% and prolong the life of diabetic patients. For more information, please see below.